This is Coded Orc Free Play. Take what you've turned and make your own drawing. You, how can you use variables with squares, pentagons, and hexagons? Ooh. Okay. So if I, I'm gonna have fun with this. Let's start with squares. Uh, forward, thirty times. So if we do a right angle, and then I want it divisible by four for a square. Eh, it doesn't really matter, but let's see what that does. Ah, oh, I'm going to change my length up. Let's do five. Yeah. Oh, let's do ten. So here's something I want to try. I want to have this go off center a bit. So let's see if I could do a variable. Uh, set. Do we have options? Oh, no, that's fine. So, and what if I start with a length of ten? And what I really want to do here is turn left by... Let's, what if I throw length in here? So now what we should do is draw a length of 10 pixels, but then turn by 10. Let's see. Wah! <laughs> Disaster. What if I do 30? I. Wah! Okay, what if I only adjust it by 2? Yeah, that's kind of neat. So honestly, guys, we're just having fun with this. 50. Uh, I originally did 90 here. We could do 90. <laughs> oh, and it becomes a... Oh, I want to make this longer, though. Except now I'm going to change the rotation. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm... Let's go back. Let's try 55. Wow. This is too much fun. I'm going to actually... What if I... To make it a hexagon, what if I do 45? And I might also change the... Oh, no, I like random. Ooh, I want to draw a sticker. No idea what that does. <laughs> All right, this is fun. Variables are really important and really useful in programming. And I think you get the hang of them, or getting the hang of them. At least I am. So, onward.